This summit brings together policymakers of India and France to sustain scientists in their actions and to trigger the energies and potentials for the future. To collaborate jointly and to actually build a network of technology centers, centers of excellence, centers of research. To develop more collaboration in fields that uh, are still uh, unexplored by uh, French and Indian scientists. And it's a unique event because, as you can see, um, it's already a success before, even before it has started. Technology is a great social leveler. Technology has improved longevity, reduced infant mortality, improved transportation, communication, has done a great deal of things in the last 30, 40 years. But technology has not been able to address hunger, poverty, environmental blunders. When you talk about energy production, whether it's from windmills or solar or nuclear or gas, there's no such thing as zero waste. Safety is not just the result of a series of technologies layered together it's not just saying, okay, I've got all these technologies, therefore I'm sick. It's about people, and it's about culture. Mechanism, especially on the uh, lymphocytes. Computer scientists, together with biologists, make a virtual liver to test in silico interventions. As a result, cataract surgeries in India become affordable and can be done safely by thousands. My name is Raghunathan, I'm a mathematician. Strong connections with the French mathematicians in the 1950s and 60s. Do you know uh, Mr. Olmo? I have not met him, but I have in contact with him by email. What is the level of the job opportunities which are created in mathematics? We are looking at the subjects which are useful. The competence like uh, aerodynamic... Uh... For example, to illustrate the application of mathematics, an airplane could not be built without mathematics. Many technologies contribute towards the making of an airplane, and mathematics is part of each. To go more to multi scale, which is integrated uh, different uh, scale from nano uh, to meter, and to go to multi. For example, for photovoltaics, we can elevate new material, new solar cells. There are some applications that are specifically relevant for India, like water purification. Habitations need water. Therefore, all cities are built around a water body. And when they grow, they need transport. Well, we, we were shifting back to mass transit. But in India, you have cities of 1 million inhabitants, more in the next 20 years. We, we talked a lot about the, the challenge in India, which is 10 times the one we have in France. India uh, has roughly 20 million people traveling on trains every day. And a lot of them, believe it or not, buy tickets. So, uh... <laughs> we're working with the large IT buildings, hotels and hospitals in, uh, in thinking about these buildings in this region. This already center will focus on multi-comfort in a frugal manner. Smart cities include every technology we can think of. It kind of reminds you of this old story of the blind man and the elephant, except that complex systems essentially comprise a large number of interacting components. Um, often these interacting components are interconnected in a complex network. An example, of course, is the brain. 
Each of the individual components of the brain, i.e. neurons, are of course complicated. I think you'll all agree that when, you know, about 10 to the power 11 neurons come together in a specific topology, suddenly the system as a whole is capable of behavior that individual neurons cannot even dream of achieving. To deliver actions out of this summit, we need science policy and multicultural management. Science policy is there to coordinate and to give efficiency and confront challenges. We had talked about Centre for Promotion of Advanced Research as the main objective of SETI Forum. Connected education, connected research, connected innovation. Very good students from India. We send French students in, in, the, in the laboratories of our partners, but also it is a question of uh, personal uh, relationships between people. The formal part of the system, the problem is the formal system doesn't adapt with this. So students will not do this unless it is aligned with the system. We don't mind if they get a degree from any university, we will get them a passport. But if they have their IIT education and content, we hire that over the time. No two learners are actually alike. Looking at the learner side will become very important. We have to find a new model of education. I trouvé qu'il y avait des, des convergences surprenantes entre les questions que les, les Indiens et les Français posaient. Moi, généralement, étaient des questions qui s'étaient posées un peu de manière universelle. Getting educators to create MOOCs. The ambassador asked me to launch a project on multicultural management in order to help the French company to understand and work with the Indian company. Set of this. Some of our production facilities here, both for solar and for biomass, is here you have a critical mass in terms of the educational institutions. So you can imagine you can go very quickly towards innovations. So I look Indian. Uh, of course, I, I was born and brought up in India, and then uh, went to the United States, uh, got my higher degrees, and then started working for a French company. So there was a decision that Veronique had to make, uh, and uh, so she put me in the French group. Science is universal, whereas technology is local. Once you enter our campus, you will not find a difference between whether you are in Europe or US or India. This many people, 500 or 400 French people under one roof in France, I had never seen that. Actuellement, on développe un super super serveur qui sera le plus gros serveur avec processeur Intel sur lequel nous allons prendre plus de 10 brevets, dont certains développés ici. Which will mean uh, thousands of jobs in the next decade or two if we are successful in such uh, initiatives. But we have a great challenge ahead of us. We can choose to remain at this level, and that's not good, or we can choose to use this foundation to go to the next level. So this technology summit is invaluable because it allows us to think about what we can do in the next level. To actually develop new cooperations with France is invaluable and our young people should be the focus of these new collaborations and our new programs in which France and India can partner in doing new things for the whole world. We have no friends, I repeat, we have no friends. France found us, gave us friendship. Never before I have seen camaraderie, apology between the Indian scientists, Indian industry. There had been a great relationship. They're waiting for an opportunity. Exactly. And they've all converged. Summit of summits. Come and come. Thank you, sir.